this, as you can see, this is a 50 watt 7 transmitter, and the LFU 50B. Um, it's a uh, multi-functional FM transmitter and it has the stable structure, excellent performance, super good sound quality and it's very easy to use. So firstly, let's take a look at the appearance of the transmitter. As you can see, obviously, the transmitter is comparatively small than, uh, smaller than the others, uh, 50 watt 7 transmitter, and it has uh, a specially small size, and 21 center, centimeter wide, and 48 centimeter long, and 4.5 centimeter high, and it weighs about 2.8 kilograms. And then let's move on to the front of the transmitter and as you can see here is the cooling hole and from where the heat comes out and there is a little screen here and there is the uh, adjusting knob and the power switch. So basically it is quite simple on the front and there is only a knob for you to adjust it so um, which also indicated that it's very very easy to use. Okay, next, let's come to the back of the transmitter. Okay, now we come to the back of the uh, FM transmitter. And for this RS232 port, uh, it's actually for factory to adjust it, so you don't need it. And this are the line port. And there are two little adjusting ports for you, and you can use the um, screwdriver to adjust it. And especially, there is a uh, microphone input, input port, which means that you can directly plug in your microphone, so you don't need any um, mixer to connect. And, and it's a little bit different from the others. Also, um, you can connect, you can plug in the audio processors or RDS encoder here and plugging the power supply here and also this for the antenna and there are the, the fans, the cooling fans here so um, basically that's all for the appearance and now let's turn it on And first of all, before you turn on the FN transmitter, uh, remember you should connect it with the uh, antenna first. And you should make sure that uh, you tighten it all the way. And plug the power supply. And now let's turn on the um, transmitter. And on the screen, we can read the current frequency is uh, 98 megahertz, and the current temperature of the uh, FM transmitter is 25 degrees, and the power output power is 50 watts, and the reflected power is 0.1, and the standing wave ratio is 1.0. And that's all that we can read from the first page. And if you turn the knob, turn the knob, you can see the second page here, which will show you the current sound mode is zero, and the line, um, the line volume is sixty. It's six and sixty, and the micro volume is fifty, right? And then we turn back to the first page. And now, if you press the knob, we come to the main menu here. And the first page is the frequency setting, and press it again. And you can set the frequency. And then press to leave. 
and for the second one is the line volume setting. The second one is the line volume setting. And press the knob to enter setting. And then you can turn the knob to adjust the volume within the range of 0 to um, 79. And then press the knob, confirm the setting and leave. Okay. And for the page 3 is the RF power setting. And you can press the knob to enter the setting and turn the knob to adjust the output power within the range of 0 to 50 um, to 50 watts. And here you can see the current uh, output power is 15.1 watts. And then you can turn the knob to set the um, output power. And then we can go back to 50. And then press and lift. And for the fourth is the um, stereo and mono mode setting. Press and then turn the knob. You can choose stereo or mono. And then press to lift. It's the same. And for the fourth, the fifth is the temperature setting. And you should pay attention that the temperature setting represent the protection setting the temperature protection setting and now we set the higher the highest temperature is 65 so if your temperature of the uh, transmitter is higher than 65 the temperature alarm will start to work so you can also adjust it higher or lower depends on the environment and the next one is the standing wave ratio protection setting and then we press the note and turn the note to adjust the standing wave ratio and keep in mind that the standing wave ratio protection point is within the range of um, 2.0 to 3.5 right okay let's go back to 2.5 here, okay, and then after adjusting, just press a lift. And now, the last one is the microphone level, and then the same, just press and you can adjust it. And now it's 50, and then you turn the knob to adjust the volume of the microphone within. 0 to 79 Okay, and then go back to 50 And that's all the information you can get If you enjoy our video, don't forget to give a big thumbs up and subscribe our channel See you next time. Bye!